customers. Hello everyone and welcome to QuickSafe TV, your number one source for Skyrim coverage on YouTube. Today we're gonna take a look at another awesome mod from Kenny, uh, which you can find on Skyrim Nexus, for links for which I will, I will provide in the description, but right now let's just talk a little bit about the mod itself. The mod is called Item Icons and it consists of 40 added icons into the game. Okay, now let's, let me just leave this notes and show you what the thing is all about. The icons are added into the game right next to the items and allow you to orient around the items quite easily. If you get used to the icons, you will even be able to identify which ones of these are simple swords, great swords, and daggers. There's many icons for arrows, for maces, for axes, and so on. It's very well organized and helps you orient around it. You have to keep in mind that it's a work in progress, and for now it consists only of four or 40 pictures. It doesn't have most of the robes, if not all of them. I would even say all of the robes don't have the icons yet. A lot of the stuff doesn't have the corresponding figures around them. The potions and poisons do, food doesn't books do and books actually also diverse Dev depending on the type of the book you have different picture this one for example is a spell tome in my books i'll show you just go we have simple books we have letters pictures for letters and notes not all of them again are pictured and you know categorized because it's a work in progress don't forget it in additional items we see some the soul gems have the pictures the gold has the picture we have the bars the ingots the ingots and the how do you call them ores yeah i i think i mentioned it right yeah ore and the lock picks all have the picture perfect i hope i didn't spoil anything for you there shouldn't be anything in the inventory okay perfect pickaxe has the picture i'm actually going to provide the list of the pictures right to the right and i have to say that how does it affect your gameplay it affects your gameplay in the next way when you play the game and you loot the bodies, you can easily identify some of the items right away and understand whether or not you should pick them up. Like, for example, in this example, I open the chest, what I see right away, a gold coin, right? And I don't have to look here anymore. I don't really depend on it anymore. Before, I would just, you know, I would scroll like this and check what is there. I would rely on this picture. Now I can rely just on this little symbol to the left. That's gold. Let me just pick it up. Here. Nothing interesting. Let's go ahead to the cupboard. What's here? Nothing interesting. Just let me be. Perfect. Oh, the key. Oh, a dagger. Perfect. Again, many of the items still don't the pictures, but it's a work in progress. And even as of as of now, it helps a lot. It has the rings, pictures, the amulets, the keys, the letters, and so on. It's just it's perfect. Honestly, I like it very much because it makes the game. It doesn't change the spirit of the game. It does not anything that wouldn't look like it belongs to the game. It just makes the user interface much more friendly and allows you to see things faster and much, much faster, much easier. Again, if you like the mod, go ahead, follow the links in the description. I will provide all the necessary links for that. If you like the video and enjoyed my commentary, go ahead, like, subscribe, and share with your friends. It was great having you here. I hope you enjoyed the mod. Good luck with modding. And if you have any questions, go ahead, ask the author or me. I might be able to help you. There is no settings as such for this mod. It's just one file and it's very easy to download. Again. If you want to download the mod, go to the site, to the, to the link provided in the description. If you liked my presentation, go ahead, like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Perfect. Have a great day, and goodbye.